Angel Meadows' reputation as Victorian Britain's most savage slum was forged by Henry Burgess and an army of thugs like him who terrorised their neighbours and even the police. By the spring of 1893, violence and poverty had become ingrained in the bricks and mortar of the slum's lodging houses, factories and beer shops. A journalist from the Manchester Guardian revealed the extent of the violence during a visit to Angel Meadow. Doors are torn from their hinges, evidence of the fierce struggles they once shut in or shut out. Now they are powerless to do either and are simply propped up against their frames and offer no shelter or protection from violence. It is all free fighting here. Even some of the windows do not open, so it is useless to cry for help. Dampness and misery, violence and wrong have left their handwriting in perfectly legible characters on the walls. Readers of The Guardian may have given an involuntary shudder when they read about Burgess and Matthews, perhaps as they cracked open boiled eggs in the breakfast parlours of Manchester's genteel suburbs. Angel Meadow was more alien to them than the jungles of uncharted Africa, but the ill-named slum was part of a world that they had created, a heart of darkness in the world's first industrial city. <laughs>